PPA. Tá legal o que ele que burgar. Ai. Ah, ok, ok, ok. Ai, Gavé. That's a good one. You are focused. Give me one way ticket, Gavé. Out. No, but you. Yeah. From what we had been told, like, yes. This is your chance to go. O que fica o que? Mangalane. Ok. You know? So, uh, two weeks, tunafaku when that trip is cancelled. Zandio, nakuambia hapa opportunity, uh, ikipatikana, it, it, it gets the people who are ready. Ok, yeah, so let's fast forward kidogo. Uh, how did you get scouted to to come play uh, college uh, for college in the US? You know, because uh, uh, you know, like it, it was very unusual. You know, like especially at that time. Okay. Um, Lawrence, what was your journey? Yeah, as in, you told us until where you, you where you at class four you realized okay I was good at this. Now, what was your journey like on playing you? uh soccer in Kenya especially now that you moved from playing uh with that uh paper ball you're going to organize mm-hmm. football right organize football uh did you go through any uh, 18 and the 20s uh, uh and a 30s team and then any local estate teams because I can say like for me mine was more in the um, Impala leagues and then took Impala leagues Nick and uh Maisa from Maisa mm-hmm. went to Inter uh, Nairobi, the Nairobi Nini, <coughs> Nairobi County League with uh, Sakayonso. Mm-hmm. I love to play in rugby. So, what was your journey? My journey was so after class four, I was sent to uh, St. Mary's Masocha in Kisi. So, I, I, I went to boarding school. So, uh, 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 <laughs> yeah, so gaki, gaki. You know, uh, I went there and I because and it's kind of the first place I we played on grass. Imagine talking like Robin can have chosen a ball to see we have kind of nyas. And I was like, all right, so at least we had a goal post we're playing with uh, <laughs> now uh inflated balls it took it was one ball though yeah between yeah. 400 400 uh, students <laughs> and me up on the standard five i'm playing against standard eights it was so it it just it, to me now looking back it was playing wreck because there was no organization it was just if you're good enough, you play. And I did that. Nikamaliza primary in Kenda Chemelila Academy. Uh, Mika, you spoke about Chemelila Sugar Company. By the time I was in Form 2, they already were like, all right, you're coming to play for the for the company team. Uh, you know, my parents said never would never happen because they were thinking of other things at that point. So credit to everything. Uh, my soccer journey was just i don't want to say it was sheer luck because looking back now the amount of time i spent on the fields playing with my friends you know uh making sure my grades were okay or good enough to allow my parents to you know let me play when other kids were not playing it was all in preparation for you know this one moment that uh it so happened in two, beginning of 2003 uh, I want to give credits to people like uh, Coach uh, John Bobo Yugi. I think he was uh, one of the pioneers of getting, you know, students to come to the U.S. And at that point, he had this team with, in conjunction with uh, Mayor Joe Cage to for Nairobi City Council U18. And uh, the idea was to uh, have an exchange program with the city of Denver. So in 2003, after I'd finished my Form 4, we had this thing where there was a group of kids of about 25 exchange program with the city of Denver, and we were coming to play teams in Denver. But in the back of our heads, this was our one-way trip out of Kenya. Like, 
tell your parents kwa heri kila kitu ilikuwa imejipa can you hear me? So, yeah, so, yeah, so, yeah. Tuna skiza. Yeah, but let me okay. get this straight. Okay, okay. You're paying attention. Yeah, You're paying attention but, because but let me get this straight. Journey. So you came to uh-huh. Denver. You did not get your. You were not recruited on a scholarship from Kenya. So you came. The story to, gets better. Yes. Okay. All right. Okay. So so so, so let's continue. Better. Let's continue. <laughs> yeah. So we've been training for about seven months. So from the beginning of 2003 January. Back uh, around August, we've been training every day. This is the first time I can credit my coaches. Uh, I don't know if you guys know, know the name Sunguti. Yes, he was playing for Amistad. At that, so he was the first guy who actually. I'm 18 at this point. First guy to give me structure, like Lawrence. This is how midfielder plays. This is how centre back plays. I mean, as much well, as well, I was. Well, this Mori Sunguti. Yeah, ni uh, George Sunguti. I'm the older one. The older one. Okay. So he's the first guy at 18, 19 who actually gave me structure in high school. My English teacher who loves football is the one who's trying to tell you, ah, this is how we'll play. So two weeks to Denver trip. This is in maybe, I want to say, uh in june two weeks we are supposed to come, go to denver so now you're too, we all know the story in kenyan whatever two weeks to the <laughs> day uh, we are seeing different players coming in man. wow okay what I, I you've been, you been training for seven months Jayon. wow wow okay to, to me later, we are told like okay these are the guys who are going and i want to say this joe coach bob Coach Bob, Alisema, who are these? Aliuliza, who are these guys? They have never come to training. But so much of CSA in Nairobi. Joe Ketch knew as Yoani. So what was as Yoani was doing? Wainge. 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 Alikata. Akasema, if these guys who've been training for seven months are not going, this trip is cancelled. It's done. It won't happen. So <laughs> my mother, who's been, see, I'm a Kijika kamua for the last seven months, fair daily, lunch, nini, wende mazoezi. Yana jua, mm. July, my son is leaving. Yes. Mm. For Two weeks to that time, alambiwa, hey, uh, trip is done. Huh? Had you secured no, passport kida. by then and everything? I'd said bye to everybody. No, but oh. you had your passport, documents, all those things were set. Like we had been told that this was the plan. This is it. So, d- yes. this is it. Stay by, we are going one way. Like, to kifika uko, mitin. Na usha pea na maambam zako, umepea na cassette tape, kila kitu. Marege, madam zote, umepea. Ata galpen, ni chanki, good guy. Ay. Ah, okay, okay, okay. Ay, shikave. That's a good one. You are focused. Ini one way ticket, gave out. No, but, you know, yeah. from what we had been told, like, yes. This is your chance to go. Ukifika uko mngangane. Okay. You know? So, uh, two weeks, tunafaa kuenda trip is cancelled. Sasa ndiyo nakuambia hapa opportunity, uh, ikipatikana, it, it, it gets the people who are ready. Man, within those two weeks, Coach Bobaka come to the, the whole team. Kasema, okay, the trip is done, blah, blah, blah. But I have these opportunities and scholarships. First question. Nani ame maliza form 4? Can you go out to car 40? So there was 40 of them. So who's done their high school? Okay, no, I'm calling on maybe like 20 people. Nani uh, ilipata C plus and above? Group ika shuka tukabaki kama watu 8. Nani ilipata zingine tukiendelea? Tukabaki kama 4 people. Wow. Next question was, have you sat for your SATs? Let me see. At, at this point, I didn't even know what SAT is. Tafal. Tafal. Unafikiri ni kiti? Sikuwa na jua yu nini. Yeah. But, akamuliza like, uh, so how did you do in school? Nini, nini. Luckily, there was a test coming in like, I want to say week. two weeks. Okay. So, tukambiwa afaneni, nye ndeni mjaribu. Ini patapia kitabu watu kwa mbae. Like I said, iku kwa mzuri na opportunity kikupata. We went and did our ACTs without his own coaching. You didn't meaning. prep or anything but for the, the time we were getting our, No. 
by wow. the time we get this is me and my friend Anito Hezbun. He'll probably be watching this tomorrow. Say and Alam. We we got results that said we passed. Wow. In four days, Nelikwa you.